Hi, I'm Nolene Culligan, and today we're going to learn how to add an assignment in Microsoft Teams. So to begin today, I do recommend that you are in the Microsoft Teams app. You can access Microsoft Teams through the browser. And the most fantastic thing about this is that Microsoft Teams can be accessed on any device, whether it be a Windows 10 device, an Apple device, or an iPad, um, even even a Chromebook through the browser. So today I'm just going to show you how to add an assignment to your Teams. Most important, you need to make sure that you've set up your team as a classroom. So once you've set your class up, uh, your team up, if you want to create a team, you need to make sure that it is a class. The assignment feature does not work on the other teams. I have a classroom here called the Caligan Classroom, so I'm going to add an assignment here. So to do that, all you need to do is go to Assignments, which is up here on the top, and you click on Create. So we can create our first assignment here. So we're going to create an assignment. And the great thing about this is once you've created your template, you can actually duplicate that for further classes. So we're going to call this assignment task one. And in terms of instructions, I'm just going to say, please read the assignment sheet. And what I would do here is I would actually attach that assignment sheet. So I can actually grab this from either my OneDrive or I can grab this from my computer as well. Um, and just for today, I might just grab a file out of here. And here we're going to allocate points. So this task will be out of 10. Now this is the most exciting part about this. You can actually add a rubric and this rubric is fantastic. So I can use one that I've already created or I can create a new one. So I'm just going to call this marking criteria task one. And here is where I can add um, my points. So here could be on for instance, presentation, and I would add the criteria here. So I'm just going to write excellent and I'm going to change these to scores. And if I wanted to add some more down here, I can certainly do that. Um, I could earn it says something such as um, vocab. Obviously, your rubric would have a lot more information than what I'm putting in here for today. And once you're done, I would click on attach. So the students can see that marking rubric. The fantastic thing is that once all students um, open their assignment and you've marked it, they can actually see how you've marked against it. We're going to allocate that to all of the students. So if you want to personalize your assignments, you can. Now, this is the really important part here. This assigns the students in the future. Always edit this and add this to students who do join your class late because it is difficult to assign them the assignment afterwards. Set a due date. So we're going to set this for the end of the month and post this will be posted to the general comments so once we assign that all of the students in my class will be able to receive this assignment and they'll be able to see it which is located there so the students too will click on assignments click on here they will be able to get their task the student here they'll be able to see their task see the marking criteria and complete it and once the students see that in their own view they will have a submit button and they will be able to hand that in and that is how you use an assignment on Teams. Very, very simple.